Hello. This is a very special edition called uh, Reaction to To The Ark. Uh, mainly because, if you're not sure, if you don't know, yesterday, last night, To The Ark responded to the latest Marble Hornets entry. And it's very interesting. I'm not going to watch it because I already have. It's only about 30 seconds long. And usually it's kind of... Mm, sorry, here. It's kind of hard to figure out what he's talking about. But I've done a lot of thinking about it. And this is a very oh shit entry. Kind of like how entry, um... A very oh shit entry. Kind of like how... I forget which one it was. Distortion? No. Uh, I need to look this up. Give me a second. But it was, a, it was the, um... second. DK. That's the one. I know it started with a D. DK. It's sort of like DK where, um, to the arc, one of uh, the Mouseys, probably Hoodie, actually, called Alex out directly. The entry was directed right towards Alex and basically threatened him. And inside that hidden message was, inside that mess inside that video, encoded in the video, was a hidden message that said, today is your last birthday. Again, it's directed towards Alex. Um, kind of like that, oh shit, reaction. Much like reference. Much like reference is an oh shit reaction as well, because that was the revelation that Maskey's back. This one is also as much of a huge oh shit as those two. Because um, of a few subtle references... The to the Ark, what To the Ark says in this video is he says, uh, you abandoned him. He's searching for you. And along the way, you know, same as like, I remember, and then the same way. But those two key phrases, you abandon him, and he's searching for you, are very, like, whole, like, they, they're the ones I'm going to concentrate on when I talk. Because that's the important stuff. Because if you pause... You pause at uh, 26 seconds. You actually see uh, Jessica's face. A friend of mine pointed that out to me. You see Jessica's face at 26 seconds. Now, that might give you a clue of who To The Ark is talking to. To The Ark could be talking to Jessica. Which means that Jessica is still alive. And if it's, think about it. Jessica abandoned Jay. Well, no, he didn't. Really, she didn't abandon Jay because the operator pulled her out. I assume so. No, no, no. I'm thinking about this all wrong. I'm not thinking in the chronological order. She did abandon Jay. We don't know what happened to her. But think back to season two, when Jay went back into the room to find, uh, to find Jessica. Jessica was gone, and instead he finds uh, her phone number. And her phone number is the, the security code to unlock the, the, the safe underneath his bed. I think that was entry 33. So Jessica could have, well, just ran off. That's a good, that's an explanation. None of the mask, not, neither Masky nor Hoodie went to get her. She ran. So if that's true, and what To The Ark says we should always take it with a grain of salt, then, yeah, Jessica totally abandoned Jay. And... Jay certainly is searching for Jessica. He is searching for you. Jay is searching for Jessica. Has been since the end of season two. So that's one interpretation that fits. The second interpretation is a little more chilling. Because that, that interpretation is that to the arc is talking to Alex. Alex abandoned someone. Abandoned Jay? Yeah. Abandoned Tim. Most definitely abandoned Brian. And even Seth. Tim just abandoned pretty much... No, Tim. Alex Brunch just abandoned everybody. But what's different is that when you watch it, watch it again, but watch the text of uh, when it says, you abandoned him. Watch the text, because then it changes to, I saw. So I saw you abandon him. To the arc saw either Alex or Jay or Jessica even abandon somebody else. But what's confusing is the next phrase, he is searching for you. 
Because when you watch that, the text changes. And Alex, the, Alex's name, is overlapped onto he is. So it could read as Alex, he is searching for you. Or Alex is searching for you. Now, yeah, it could be directed at, at Jessica still, saying Alex is searching for you. Alex is searching for Jessica. Possibly because she knows too much. Or Alex, he is searching for you. Alex, he is searching for you. As in Tim is searching for you. Jay is searching for you. Um, it's one of those... It, it, on the surface, it looks like To The Ark calls out Jay on abandoning Tim. That didn't happen. Tim, to me, watching Entry 64, it clearly said that it, to me, it seemed like Tim was telling Jay to run. It looked like that to me. It looked like Tim was telling Jay to run. If that's the case, then no, Jay did not abandon Tim. But on the surface, that's what it looks like. But I don't think that's true. Looking closely, looking, looking closer at it, I don't think that's true at all. It's a very oh shit and reaction because it, it's going to... It, there's going to be a shitstorm coming up very soon. There's going to be a very... A lot of things are going to come down. And very soon, I hope so. Because this this is... To the Ark is calling out on somebody. Whether it's Tim, whether it's Alex, whether it's Jay, or it's Jessica. Somebody is going to get their shit wrecked very soon. By the, To the Ark, by Hoodie, by Maskey, by the Operator, by Alex. I don't know. That's the best part, is that I don't know what's going to happen next. I just know something big is going to happen because of, because of To The Ark's response. To The Ark is pissed, and To The Ark is going to wreck someone's shit. This is a bit of a long... This is long. This took a little bit longer than I thought it would. I'm sorry for taking up so much time, but I just wanted to offer my uh, analysis, what I thought uh, the last To The Ark entry was about, and uh, I guess I will see you... It's, this one is a little more straightforward than what we're used to from To The Ark. So, anyways. So, I'll catch you probably next week before Entry 65. And, uh, have a good weekend, guys.